This is the Riverhawk Report, a weekend recap, and it was a busy weekend. It was, in many ways, a terrific weekend. Field hockey, women's soccer, ice hockey, basketball, both men and women, and volleyball all in action, and the positives far outweighed the other options. The field hockey Riverhawks defeated Merrimack 3-1 in the national semifinal, but came up a goal short in the national championship game. The Riverhawks were beaten by Westchester. 2-1 was the final. For UMass Lowell, this was supposed to be a rebuilding year. The Riverhawks finished the season with a 19-4 record. It was their sixth appearance in the finals in the last seven years. It appears safe to say the future looks bright. UMass Lowell women's soccer still playing. A couple of shootout wins have propelled the Riverhawks into the NCAA Division II East Region Final. UMass Lowell battled Dowling last Friday to a scoreless tie but advanced on penalty kicks 5-3. Sunday, they earned a 1-1 tie with the top seed Bridgeport and again advanced in the shootout. Friday, the Riverhawks will face the second seed, the College of St. Rose. UMass Lowell volleyball season came to a close last Friday night. The Riverhawks were defeated by St. Rose 3-0 in the Northeast 10 Conference Tournament semifinal. The Riverhawks finished the year with a 13-11 record. The UMass Lowell Hockey Riverhawks had a terrific weekend in Orono, Maine. They swept the two-game weekend series with the University of Maine in the Alphond Arena for the first time since 1985. 5-3 was the score the first night. Matt Ferreira had two goals in that one. The second night featured a four-goal third period explosion, a 4-3 come from behind victory. Riley Wetmore had two goals in that one, three on the weekend. Chad Ruedel had the game winner. Scott Wilson had highlight reel goals each night and was named the Hockey East player of the week for the second week in a row. The Riverhawks were named Hockey East's Team of the Week. UMass Lowell visits the University of New Hampshire Friday. They host UMass Amherst at the Saugus Center on Saturday. The basketball season is here. The women split two games during the weekend. They grabbed the season opener. Head coach Sarah Baines, UMass Lowell coaching debut Saturday. A 71-65 win against Felician. Shanae Bushner and Brianna Wilson each hit for 19 points. Sunday, the Riverhawks got beat by Holy Family. An 87-62 loss. Wednesday, UMass Lowell women visit Bentley. UMass Lowell men's basketball, a winner twice during the weekend. Saturday, it was run and gun. A 108-105 win over Bridgeport. Five Riverhawks in double figures. Akeem Williams hit for 35 points. Dipanjo Singh threw in 24. Sunday, UMass Lowell defeated Post University 60-50. Akeem Williams topped the scoring with 18 points. The Riverhawks visit Bentley on Wednesday evening. And that's the Riverhawk Report.